you guys, it is Faith. Welcome back to another video on the channel. Today, I'm gonna be deep cleaning my entire bedroom, like literally decluttering and organizing everything. We might get into the closet a little bit, which I am going to do a whole separate closet organization, closet makeover video. I am gonna be completely transparent with you guys. I did not wanna film a video this week. I, for some reason, felt so unmotivated to film and to uh, clean my room, apparently. But I thought it would be really good for me to get motivated, to motivate you guys by just getting up and getting things done. Though I went on vacation just a couple of weeks ago, I just feel like I'm in like this creative rut and like I feel unmotivated to do things for some reason. But I think cleaning and decluttering and just kind of pushing myself to get a fresh restart for the new week, I think it would boost my mood a lot more. So I'm going to take you guys along with me on that. I hope you guys enjoy this cleaning video and without further ado, let's get right on into the vlog. like a world difference of what my room looks like. I didn't put my decorative pillows on there just because it is like 5 30 p.m. and I'm gonna be like getting in bed in a few hours so I just laid it out simple like this. I'm gonna come on over on this side. I'm gonna just like clear the whole desk, wipe everything down, dust everything and put things back and make it more organized. Also I have my fan here. I turn this on every night. It used to be by my bed, but the dust of the fan gave me really bad allergies, so I kind of put it away at a distance. So this is definitely gonna be staying, but this isn't like a permanent piece on my desk. is my vanity area so because it is getting later in the day and because of like lighting issues and stuff I'm just gonna organize this whole section and then tomorrow dive deep into this closet area just because this is gonna be a whole other video basically to like clear everything out so I'm just gonna wait on this tomorrow and I'm just going to clean this off and organize all of these drawers. This has like a bunch of like makeup and skincare products. But like, look at this, you guys. It's a mess.
things that were in my drawer. Mostly hair stuff, because this is like where I do my hair. Scrunchies, clips, my deodorant, just like things I would typically grab while I'm getting ready. Nail filers even, like all of the things. So it can get pretty messy pretty quickly. I think it would be really cool to get like dividers. I'm gonna try to organize this to best of my ability. Meanwhile, being realistic, um, instead of like just tossing random things in, just kind of make it more of an organized mess, if that makes sense. But there's a few things that I don't really use, like this clip. I never use these kind of clips. I'm getting rid of that. Um, this headband, I use that to wash my face. I think I'll put that in my bathroom. This used to be a scrunchie. It unfortunately broke. It looked like these. I got these from Target. I really love these huge scrunchies because I love wearing low ponytails. But this one broke on me and I wore this one the most. And it's too big to be like one of these headbands. So I don't really know what to do with this. I might have to like toss it. I have my clips, which I'm obviously gonna keep. Unfortunately, this black one broke. Do you guys see? Like, I think it's a screw problem or something. I have no idea, but I might have to reorder one. Um, I think I was pretty reckless with this on vacation because I put it in my purse and I think it got squished. So, uh, pro tip, don't squish your clips. <laughs> Here is the after. It definitely looks a lot more organized. Basically anything that I just grab on a daily basis is on this side. And I organize the hair ties a little bit, all my scrunchies, all my clips, and I think it looks really good. Now let's pass it on to my makeup drawer. drawers are nice and organized I actually got rid of a ton of like empty products as you can see from the trash can <laughs> featuring the Pez bottle and old coupons but now the sun is set and it's gonna get super dark any minute now so I'm gonna go ahead and put a pause on this cleaning video I'll get back to it tomorrow and we can pick up on organizing the closet a little bit again not the full closet makeover but a good start to like purging everything so i will catch up with you guys tomorrow morning okay you guys it is the next day and i am finally getting into organizing my closet so here is the before i want to purge through all of my clothes I have some things in this dresser that I want to organize. I did do some purging earlier on, so it might not do too much, but I definitely need to up here. I need to reorganize as well as the other side here. I have more clothes to purge. Um, this stuff at the bottom on this dresser right here is pretty much like organized and stuff so i don't think i'll touch that area too much i think this side has been organized but i'll definitely go through it again but this is the main thing that we're working on today we have a lot of work to do um i'm gonna first go through the clothes Look at how many clothes I had in my closet. My closet is completely emptied out of all the clothing, except for like my prom dresses and stuff, like my fancier, fancier dresses. I just tucked back here because I'm not planning on getting rid of them anytime soon. So they're just gonna stay in the corner like they always have. But basically I wanna take all of these clothes and organize them by like clothing style. So like by tank tops, by sweatshirts, that kind of thing. So I'm gonna do that.
the closet is cleared and all organized. So over here I have all of my outerwear, so like my winter outfits, and then it goes to um, like sweaters, long sleeves, crew necks, and then on this side I have all of my short sleeves. I need more short sleeve shorts, that's for sure. Tank tops, I need to get a few more basic tank tops. And then I have like some dresses, which I think I'm going to move on to the other side because I don't wear these dresses too much. And then I have some pants hung up. So I might actually just swap this to the other side. The reason why I want to put the dresses on this side is because there's more room for them to just hang down below. Okay, that looks a lot better because the dress kind of covers up some of the mess that's going on over there. Um, it's just a huge box of like some decor that I didn't take out when I first moved in. So I'm just gonna leave that there. Also look how many clothing pieces I'm looking to get rid of. Like this huge stack of things. I don't know if I wanna sell them. All of the extra hangers too. This just means I need to get more clothes. <laughs> that, that, that's what I'm hearing here. Next, I'm gonna go through this dresser. I have all of my tech things to go through. And then I have like finances, stationery, that kind of thing. So these are the two dressers I'm gonna take care of because in here is literally just my tripod. You guys, oh gosh, you guys look at the aftermath of this drawer. It looks so good. Okay, so to dive deep a little bit into what this drawer is, um, I have a lot of like coloring books because I feel like one day I'm going to get into coloring or if I just really need something to be creative. I have like adult coloring books, but I also have like these planner stickers and a sketchbook and all these pens and pencils and stuff. So that's what this side is all about. And then this side, this is just like a notebook that's like pretty much empty. This is a book I really want to get into. I might actually put it in this dresser right here because it's going to be by my bed. So I'm going to put that in there. And then this is my planner. For this year, I actually have gone digital with my planner, so I don't really know if I want to like switch this up to a different kind of planner, like a financial planner or what. This used to be my everyday planner, and then um, it was my content planner. Now it's just like pretty much boring. It's just like pretty much an empty notebook that has a few notes on it, so I wanted to keep it in case I needed a pad of paper. And then this binder right here, I definitely want to organize my finances. Now that I'm like making money and like working from home and all that, I definitely want to organize my finances. So um, a lot of like bank statements, a lot of receipts, like all of like the random like paper stuff um, is in this binder. But I definitely want to... Um, I definitely want to make this look a lot better because it honestly is not super organized. I just threw everything in this one binder. As well as this binder. So I actually have like a ton of like papers and photos, lanyards, and random like memories in this binder. I call this my memory binder. And I definitely want to transform this into a box but for right now it's just a binder so i'm just leaving that in there for now but everything else looks so 
organized. But yeah, we got this. And then we have the tech drawer, which is all nice and organized. So this whole thing is all done. I'm low-key nervous to purge everything up here, but it has to be done, you guys. So um, I don't think I'm going to go through this because this is so heavy filled with like books and stuff and last time i did it it literally fell on me so we're gonna skip this part but we're gonna go through these bins and see what's up with that when you're cleaning your room and you're purging. I don't think it's healthy to breathe in at all, but YOLO. Okay, I'm done. My closet is completely cleaned out now. This is what it looks like right now, but overall my closet actually looks really neat. Painting to everything that I need to get rid of, not bad at all, you guys. I think this was a really successful clean with me. Update, I folded up all of the clothes and I found this giant box in the garage. So I'm just gonna place everything in this box and then put it in the garage. Do I really wanna do that? Until I figure out what I wanna do with this. Cause there is like a community garage sale coming up. So I might be able to sell the majority of the stuff and then like, put them on like Poshmark or Depop or something. But for right now, I need to have a place to put these items because I don't want them just lingering in my closet. Okay, all of the things that I'm looking to get rid of, including this pillow, fit in this box. battery is dying so this is a perfect way to close out the video i hope you guys enjoyed this video if you did make sure you give it a thumbs up comment down below if you want me to do more clean with me videos more room videos all that kind of stuff comment down below what you guys want to see on my channel don't forget to subscribe i upload new videos every friday at 12 p.m pacific and if you want to keep up with my day-to-day -day life go ahead and follow me on instagram and tiktok and all of those other social medias those will be linked down in the description as well i hope you guys have a wonderful day and i'll see you guys in my next vlog next week bye